How y'all doing today? It's your boy Jermaine from Shovel Nose Hogs back with another quick feeding video. And um, before I get to the feeding video, I'm just gonna announce a few videos that I have in mind that I want to produce for this channel. Um, one of the videos is to produce a video talking about the hypogene. And this is the last major morph that I haven't made a video on. And the reason why I haven't made a video on is because I have a hard time identifying the, the hypo, especially differentiating the true hypo and the Dutch hypo and the Evans hypo. So I'm going to do some more research on that and I'll probably come up with that video this week. And I also want to do a video on different line bread morphs or genetics. So things such as lemon ghost, the green line, the raging red line, the purple line, different things like that. So if you know any more line bred hog nose traits that I didn't mention just now, leave them down in the description so I can add them to that video. And I think that would be pretty informative. But with that being said, hopefully you enjoyed this video. first snake today is going to be Diablo and since he's been out of brumation I'm just going to feed him two small meals every week for like the first month um, before I bump him up in size just just to make sure his GI tract and everything is back to normal so let's see if he's hungry today he's never really an aggressive eater Why my hand is shaking so much? There you go. All right, that was nice and easy. All right, next up we got my pretty girl, Hazel. And she's always ready to eat. Come on, girl. Got a bad aim. There you go. I'm really liking these sandy chips. Um, like I say, it's a lot easier to spot clean. As you can see, like right here, it's a little area that I need to spot clean. I would never have seen this with the hemp. All right, so we'll just let her finish eating and move on to the next one. And next up is my girl. Peggy, she's already PO'd. Uh, we'll see if she eats on camera today. I doubt it. Maybe we'll get lucky with the new substrate. I guess not, but literally like once I put this in there with her and leave her, she she goes right to it and grabs it within like maybe five minutes. So I'll just leave this in her enclosure and we dump this water. All right, and we'll move on to the last one. All right, last one for the day is going to be Onyx. 
Let's see. Let's see what he'll choose today. The pinky or the rusty link. Oh, uh, get the pinky. Nope. Maybe. Got it. Now I did scent the pinky, but I'm glad he just went straight for it instead of the rusty link. So no choo choo train this week. And look how quickly he eats these pinkies compared to my other hog nose meats. Especially when he gets it sideways. Let's see if he'll go and get this Rupty Link too. You don't want to eat the Rupty Link in front of the camera for the people? All right, maybe he doesn't want to eat the Rupty Link in front of y'all. So just put him back in his enclosure. I'm sure he'll eat it in private. All right, and hopefully y'all enjoyed that video. If you haven't already, you can subscribe to the channel, like this video, leave a comment below. And you can also follow me on my other social media profiles, such as Facebook, Instagram, and Discord. And I'll see y'all for the next one.